things I love about baseball is that the game doesn't change. You have to play by the rules. Of course, my little brother thinks playing a game means making up the rules as you go along. B.A.T. spells dinosaur. You're very close, Fudge. No more cookies before dinner. X-T-O-P-O-S. Extapos? Extapos. That sounds like an exotic Mexican resort. Yeah, that's it. What's a resort? It's a place where you have fabulous meals, like the one your father and I are going to have tonight at the Tubman's. Oh. Uh. Oh, hi, Shu. Hi, Mrs. Hatcher. Sheila! Um, Mrs. Hatcher? Mom's a little behind on the hors d'oeuvres and wanted to know if you could come down early to help. <laughs> What's she making this time? Oh, nothing too fancy. Just smoked salmon eclairs with caviar. Too fancy. <laughs> Whatever happened to carrot and celery sticks? Oh, nothing. Mom just calls them al dente vegetable spears. Tell her I'll be down as soon as Peter gets home to watch Fudge. Oh, that's okay, Mrs. Hatcher. I'll watch him. I just finished my babysitting class. I'm the perfect babysitter. Oh, please, can I? Well, Peter will be home in a few minutes, but if you want to watch Fudge till then, that would be a big help. I can do better than that. I can make sure he gets to bed on time. I never gonna go to bed. Fudge? You want Sheila to put you to bed tonight? I'm not going to bed tonight. I'm staying up all night. Not tonight, you're not, Fudge. Okay, emergency numbers here on the fridge. Okay. Ah. Good planning, Mrs. Hatcher. Of course, fire, police, and paramedics are covered by 911. Oh, Sheila, I want you to be my babysitter. Is there a problem? Well, yes. You have Fudge's doctor, but where's the number for the nearest hospital? Um, front page of the phone book. Okay, and when was the last time you checked your smoke detector batteries? Two months ago, I think. And who should I call if I find any exposed asbestos? <laughs> Look, Sheila, maybe this isn't such a good idea. Relax, Mrs. Hatcher. What could possibly go wrong? You're right. I'll just be downstairs. And Sheila, please tell Peter that dinner is in the microwave. I'll do that. I'm starving. Well, would you like a little snack? No. I want a big snack. I got a good maybe you will. You should really work on your table manners, Fudge. Why? Well, because it's a great social skill to have a meal with someone. <laughs> Without being disgusting. Disgusting? Grossing someone out. Like that. That is not good. That is disgusting. Am I disgusting? Yes. No, not you personally. Just your table manners. Do, 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 do. Okay, I'll be disgusting. Repeat. Well, you do that. Oh, done. Let's go play. Wipe your hands first. Oh boy. Disgusting, disgusting. I'm disgusting. Disgusting, disgusting. Yes, you certainly are. Here's some old baseball tickets. Pete loves the Mets. <laughs> I'm sure he's going to love what you've done to his tickets. Here's Pete's glove. Want to smell it? Uh, no thanks. It smells good. <laughs> ah. Uh, Fudge, are you sure Pete doesn't mind us being in here? Nope. He likes it. <gasps> Here's a baseball. It's no good because someone wrote on it. Kevin Fry. I know who he is. That's BT. And what are these marks? I slammed it too. Well, then it must be worth even more now. That's not what Pete said. He said a bad word. 
Wow, this is gonna be fun. This is where Pete keeps all his good stuff. Look at all these baseball cards. Ooh, this is Pete's hockey hat. wasted a lot of money on baseball cards, Fudge. And he doesn't even have a Kevin Fry card. What do you think you're doing? shows how much you know. It's a very rare card. No one has it. I do. No way. Kevin Fry, Peter Hatcher's hero, is all mine. Bye! Guess the word. Hmm. Rutabaga? Rhinoceros? Good guess. Well, then I give up. <sighs> Bismarck. Oh, right. Bismarck. Next time, sound it out. Okay. There's no way you have a Kevin Fry card. Yes, I do. I got it as a party favor. Don't make me laugh. Guess the word, Gia. He's a Met. There's only about 900 Mets if you include current and inactive players. And he has a mustache. So do you. Press the word now, Sheila. It doesn't matter if you don't believe me. <sighs> the point is, I have a Kevin Fry card and you don't. <laughs> Prove it. Get the card. I would, but I'm watching Fudge. Doing a great job, too. Fudge! <laughs> Fudgey! Fudgey! Oh, Fudgey! 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 Oh, Fudgey! door. Then you'd really be in trouble. Peter! There's no way you can reach the locks. Well, aren't you going to help me find it? You're the babysitter. You find it. Peter, this is 
serious. It's way past Fudge's bedtime. Maybe we should call your parents? Don't you dare! I can find Fudge with my eyes closed. Hey, Fudge! Want some ice cream? It's your favorite chocolate syrup. So? We could have a problem. I told you. Fudge! Come out now! Fudge! He's got to be around here somewhere. I'm ruined. I'll never babysit in this town again. Yeah, lucky for this town's babies. You know, this isn't exactly all my fault. Oh, so you're saying it's my fault? As a matter of fact, yes. Hi, guys. Oh, Mom went up to the party a long time ago, Dad. Uh, I've probably missed dinner already, but with any luck, not your mother's dessert, which is... Uh, she made tiramisu. Oh, with mocha sprinkles? Uh-huh. Oh. Fudge in bed yet? Uh, no. It's past his bedtime. Uh, we'll have him right to bed, Dad. Good, good, good. Well, we'll be up soon. Where is Fudge, anyway? Uh, we're uh, playing hide and seek. Yeah, hide and seek. Oh, sounds fun. As long as nobody gets lost, right? Right. <laughs> <laughs> Bye, guys. Bye, Fudge. Drexel Hatcher, enough fooling around. They're never gonna find me. <laughs> That's it. You come out right now. Help me, Pete. Help me. Fudge, where are you? Maybe your head got bigger. Maybe I'm getting smarter. Maybe, but I doubt it, because what kind of washer would the kitchen sink? Would it be so wrong to leave him there? Not for that long. Maybe just until I leave for college. I should check the phone book. Yeah, great idea. Why don't you check under H for head shrinker? Your brother's in danger and you're making jokes? Well, how are we going to get him out? The answer is easy. If he's stuck, we have to unstick him. Yeah, why are we just unstick me? You know, when I have trouble getting a ring off, I use soap to make it slippery. Hmm? Good idea. Hmm. No soapy, please, no soap. It tastes terrible. So what do we use then? Have a butter. Margarine, it's healthier. Yeah, margarine will be good too. We don't have any. Mm. <gasps> How about this, Fudge? Chocolate syrup. Yeah, it'll work, Fudge. Go ahead, try it. Oh, yes, try that. Oh, stop eating, Fudge, and try and get out. It's not working. Maybe butterscotch would help. If you don't try and get out of there, I'll drag you out, even if it means leaving your ears behind. No, I need my ears. Oh, 
My head's coming off. Good. It's working. Oh, that's it. I was supposed to be watching Fudge, and I failed. She that way. I don't blame you if you never hire me again, or even if you tell everyone what a pathetic babysitter I am. Now, Sheila. I'll even take the babysitting course again. It wasn't all our fault. I mean, none of this would have happened if I had helped earlier. What are you doing? I'm just saying I didn't take you seriously when he first got lost. Well, it's very nice of you, but... Yeah, but he's my little brother. But I was in charge. And I live here. But it was my fault, Peter. No, it wasn't. Ugh. Anyhow, I can't tell you how sorry I am. Oh, trust me. You have. Well, since you're equally responsible, you'll both clean up the mess together, right? Right. Right. Sheila! When can we be disgusting again? <laughs> Pitcher, right fielder, third base, second base, left fielder, right fielder, right fielder, first base. Peter, could you get that? Not you again. Hi, Sheila. I'm sorry to bother you. That's okay. I thought you might like the last of the tiramisu, Mr. Hatcher. Oh, my. Warren? Spoon? Sorry. You know you're going to have to go running tomorrow. That's tomorrow, isn't it? That's what, your third piece of tiramisu? Uh, I wasn't counting. I was. I was going to count. <laughs> Bye, Mr. and Mrs. Hatcher. Bye, Sheila. Oh, Sheila, tell your mom thanks. Love it. Mm -hmm. Yes, mm. tell her thank you. Right fielder, first base, second base, pitcher, left fielder. Wait, wait a minute. This is impossible. What's wrong? You missing a card? No, I have an extra one. But where did it come from? Who is it? Kevin Fry? <laughs> I used to love collecting football cards as well. Fudge back at the same time next week on CBBC. There's Meteorite Mayhem and Racing Rock.